if you guys don't know, I've been I played Stellar Blade. Gray has uh, <laughs> platinum the Stellar Blade, and he just uh came out with a video. So if you guys want to check out Gray's uh, new video, it should be in. Uh, you go check out um I think it's Mighty Loot. It should be down in the description below. He came out with a new video, but uh, Stellar Blade has been doing really really well, and um uh, kind of, yeah, it's I when I first saw the the trailer for this game, I believe it was last year. It was called Project Eve, and I'm like, damn, she got some nice ass. <laughs> right, she, she, had a, mm -hmm. she has a nice ass. I'm like, yo, oh, oh, this game looks really good. It looks like it's coming out from Korea. And I guess people, when I was watching people's reaction, they were just like, am I supposed to like this? I'm like, yes, you are. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they know what they're doing. So uh, Jen and Sylvia, do you know what Nikkei Goddess of Victory is? No. no. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> okay. First reacts. So, First reacts. so um, Nikkei, Goddess of Victory, is the same company that did Stellar Blade. Yay! Company, and it's from Korea. And let me show you, basically, this is one of their, this is the website, and this is one of their wallpapers. Wow. Uh, they can arrest me for anything. They have a <laughs> nice personality, those two. Yes. So, uh, like for me, I'm like, what is this game? So it's basically a shoot. Uh, it's sort of like a, a shooting game. But but you're using these um these characters, and they are um very good looking. And yeah. um when when they're using yeah. the when you are playing the game, and when they're shooting their guns, their back is faced towards you. And uh, the one of the main characters, her name is Rappy. Her um her nice posterior basically jiggles the entire time we're shooting the gun. So <laughs> that's just true to life. You jiggle when you shoot a gun. Yeah, this one is one of my favorite characters. Her name is Volume, Ooh. and uh, is uh, she's a singer. Ooh. And uh, and the thing is, um, I believe they might be having a Stellar Blade, uh, maybe um, crossover event. I'm not sure because they did wow. have it for um, uh, what's it called again? Uh, Near Automata. I think Two B is in this game as well. So this is the same company that did Stellar Blade. Given that the fact that a lot of people were like why did they censor the game and then we're like it's because sony censored it then they no it's not sony didn't censor the game no way um they the studio came out themselves and said they censored it themselves this is this is the design costume choice and then we look at nikkei and we're like no this is all sony yeah so yeah. Like, yeah. this is sony's doing so um but ha, ha, but yeah this game is free and uh but yeah it's, it's wow. very wow. yeah yeah this game is free yeah what can you play it on? I believe you can play on PC, and it's 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 meant to it's be also on your in the phone, phone. But you can, phone, yeah. You wow. can play this on your phone. Oh my goodness! <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure if there's any gameplay footage. Uh, but the gameplay footage is uh is pretty good. Uh, do you remember there was this rabbit girl that I was um gooning over, and when you yeah, guys just were yesterday, I believe. Just oh, yesterday. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, there was a character, and um, let, 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 let me bring up my ex here, right. Quick. <laughs> Yeah, it's like a bunny rabbit character. Let mm -hmm. me let me bring it up on my own personal account and you'll see. But um, yeah, they're the same people that did Stellar Blade. And um wow. it's uh it's it's pretty good, uh, in my opinion. And the reason why they yeah, this I think it's one of this one. Oh my oh. goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, so uh it's I saw bunny. <laughs> but the thing is, the game has been doing really, really well, and a lot of people are actually really upset. When I say a lot of people, I'm talking about the loud people that are upset online is because stellar blade tops us sales chart already one of 2024's biggest sellers so this is huge and Thanks. the fact that the game plays really well is is what's amazing how, how do you feel about this um saska twins i feel very positively this is a win for representation for hot women and i feel that we have been underrepresented and we are treated poorly and i'm happy that hot chicks are having a comeback <laughs> Uh, no pun intended with the comeback. And also, it may, when you play the game, it makes sense because she's fighting like these biological weapons that are really hideous. So you kind of want to even out what you're looking at on screen. Like there's Eve and there's a monstrosity. There's Eve, there's a monstrosity. It's cool. Also, this is like a fan reaction and the fans putting their money where they want something. I'm just so grateful that people have gone out and they've supported Stellar Blade yeah. so that even these shitty companies will be like, ah, oh, we're going to have to start making things they actually want to play we can't just put everything out i mean you see what happened with disney where they're like we don't need to listen to star wars or marvel fans we'll just do whatever and they'll like it and they didn't 
And this is a perfect example of people want more games like this with beautiful women with cool action and <laughs> great soundtracks too. But yeah, victory for mankind. Yeah, I feel like Stellar Blade and uh, the bikini scene in Final Fantasy Remake really healed the world. I feel like everybody's like, oh, that's nice. I remember the 90s. I remember all the early 2000s. It's fun. I'm downloading this uh, shooty booby game as soon as we're done, by yeah. the way. That this is all hours of work. I'm just going to be like, why is Jen on her phone? I'm shooting. It's, easy. it's for work. <laughs> doing research. Yeah, but, uh, it, it, surprisingly, the Nikkei game, like the first 15 minutes, like you, I, I don't want to spoil it, but like I did feel really sad in one of the moments. I'm like, hey, it's funny that this anime booby shooty game it's making me feel like this emotion, like sad emotions, because one of the characters, like something tragic happens to the character. I'm just like, oh, oh wow. what? Okay. So like it makes like and it's and of course, like the characters, look, all, all of them look great. And the thing is, someone mentioned in the chat in the chat basically saying hot phobia. Yeah. Like, yeah, Hollywood and a lot of these um, Western game developers and um, these companies, they they are afraid to make women look attractive is because that the male gaze right and yeah it's, i feel like it's a sad overcorrection for me too because they're all like oh shoot they caught us raping all these chicks uh what do we do just don't make women hot anymore that'll stop it right and also <laughs> the male gaze is to suggest that men looking at women is disgusting i mean that's heterophobic if you're yeah. honestly i mean when did men looking at something become a horrible thing it's how kids are made, you guys. It starts with a look, and then, you know, there's the rest of the population of the world. <laughs> and also, your body is something that is moldable. I know that we every body type is beautiful, sure. But you know you can, like, eat a certain amount, and you can work out, and you can make yourself look like you want to. You don't just have to look in the mirror and go, ah, oh, shit, well, this is all I get. It's not. It's not. You can do whatever you want. You can augment. I mean, if you're a girl, you can even wear makeup. I mean, hell, if you're a dude, you can wear makeup. Why You not? can just make yourself <laughs> into the avatar you want. You don't just have to make an avatar online. But they've always had this kind of weird censorship. Like, uh, you guys might not have heard of this, but the church actually took all the dicks off of the statues at one point. And what? Yeah, so a lot of the statues, great works of yeah, art. The yeah. Catholic Church went and took the peepees off. They, so somewhere in the Vatican, there's a vault of artistic masterpieces. So they took peepees. the they took the dicks <laughs> off. They put leaves over them instead. And now the church has all of those dicks somewhere at the Vatican. And you think why? About, and you think about it, you're like, you guys realize you're the perverts, right? You went, you took all the dicks. Like what? And and we're talking modest peepees. <laughs> like back in the day, we they were non, you know, aroused peepees. They're just they're just hanging out. They're just resting on the balls, basically. And they're like, no. Nah. So <laughs> this is gonna make people disgusting. And I'm like, Catholic Church, you're the ones going crazy over the peepees. So this is just a modern day dick collection. That's all I see. They're yeah. like, they're, except they're after the tits now. It sucks. And also, why do they keep trying to shut down the heterosexual sex? You know, we need that to continue as a human. You know? I think like, that's why kids are so confused. They don't see this stuff enough in movies. They don't see Eve and they're like, oh, what is a woman? I don't know. <laughs> yeah. So uh, I, 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 asked, I asked my wife and um, like I, for, for me, I would consider myself to be extremely, extremely fortunate and lucky um, when I when i was talking to her and i was like oh what do you think about this uh this video game character is that do you think do you find her design controversial and i showed her some of the animations and the upskirts and the, you know the down blouses and the side boob and all that stuff and she said i think she's hot like why are people wh why is there any problem with this and i think that's we need to find people who uh because girls love looking at other hot girls it's yeah. true exactly yeah you know, if you get yes. a compliment from a girl, you know it's a for real compliment. She's not trying to like sleep with you. She's like, oh, you're hot. And you're like, oh, she thinks I'm hot. I think she's hot. She must know. Yeah, when you're in the club and you're doing your makeup, all the other girls are like being sweet and complimenting each other. Like it's, it, you like to see other hot girls. It's like, I don't know. It's a pack mentality thing. Yeah. So, so here's the thing. Yesterday I was playing, Um, I was just looking at some of the Nikkei Goddess of Victory stuff. And um, I jokingly put, I'm probably gonna leave it up now. Uh, I jokingly put a, one of the Nikkei wallpapers as my um, my desktop background. My wife came in earlier today and she looked at it, and I was like, I thought she was mad, like just for a little bit. 
So this is how it looks like. Ah! This is my... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Oh, so this she's... is my this is, this is my current wallpaper, uh, and she's. I was like, oh no, is she mad or something? And then I went out and asked her. I was like, did that wall did that wallpaper bother you? He's like, no, I thought it was actually really well drawn and it was really colorful. I like it. I was oh. like, and I gave her a hug. I was like, I love you so much. Oh. It's because like she, oh. she's the type of girl who. She 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 says she does she 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 appreciates and not appreciates. That's what she always says. Oh Ooh. wow! Yeah, I'm so she, she, your missus is so like smart. she. Yeah, she always just tells me it's like I and the thing is she she recognizes like when girls are hot and she's like when we do makeup is for two things, it's for ourselves and it's for other girls. Yeah, and it's, that's it. And the thing is the fact that you can't have hot characters like that in video games is because it makes all the people who are self conscious think twice about how they look it's like hey, you know what i don't i i shouldn't worry about you know the fact that i'm like 300 pounds 400 pounds and i shouldn't worry about myself and then you have these people who are around them basically telling them oh you're fine you're fine you look great the way you are don't do anything about your uh, about your overweight you know and i think those are the people who are actually detrimental to their lives it's 100%. Because yeah, if, they're not you're... allowed to be, to be really confident in their skin they're just saying oh just just be fine with how you are even though you don't like it yeah but uh yeah I, i'm glad that um th in my opinion i think this is a big win for video game i i would like to see more um more stellar blade hearing that we that it's going to get ported to pc and we might uh we're probably going to get a part two i think that's going to be huge and i hope that shift up learns their lesson and not go with playstation ex uh at least timed exclusive moving forward but i can't so you guys haven't played the game yet are you guys going to be playing the game soon I am. I am. I was just so afraid because I heard that if you hook up to the internet, you're going to lose some of the sexy outfits. But then you guys are telling me that they re-released those outfits just in different colors. So you're still kind of getting it. I've been watching a lot of people play Stellar Blade and I just, I can't wait to play it myself. I mean, I feel like, I feel like it's everything I want. And it's funny that you mentioned the emotional beat because I was watching uh, Heel versus Babyface play it and he was killing these monsters. And then this emotional part happened and I was like, oh, Oh no, is Eve gonna die? And I was like, this is actually really cool. I didn't think I would be like emotionally invested like that, but I totally wasn't. And then spoiler, someone saved her, and I was like, fuck yeah, this is cool. I love it. <laughs> I'll definitely play. Uh, I love the new game plus option. I love any game with a new game yeah. plus because yes. you struggle through the first time and you're like, now I'm gonna kick your asses. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah I'm looking forward to um all the all the weirdos online who are getting very upset that this game is actually doing really, really well, which is I'm happy for that. Go to the gym then. Get some makeup. You know, go out there and sculpt your body to be however you want. Don't hate on a non-existent person. Yeah. Eve isn't real. She can't hurt you. And if you don't like the game, <laughs> just go play solitaire or some shit. It can't hurt you unless you think you know the queen is too objective. The queen's too hot. Get this part. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for checking out this segment of the Project Egg Row podcast. If you like what we do here, please like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and you will know next time when we go live. We do go live every Saturday at 8 p.m. Once again, we are just getting started. Tons of more video to come. Thanks, and we'll see you guys next time.